Finally, Sam gets into the driver's seat <laughs> after a lot of bleeding, I would say. Please look at this unbelievable road and the sky in front of us. Awesome. White clouds on nice bright blue skies, nicely tarred, smooth road with big dividers, properly marked lanes. It's absolute super fun driving on this road. Just tanked up, 18.33 is the FE. That was flat out, 100 kilometers an hour. Flat out! <laughs> Not like Jiggy's. Flat out! <laughs> Oh, we just saw uh, harvester for farm miller fans. Ah. <laughs> yeah, we've actually we've come across hardly any badly behaved trucks. Huh? Yeah, and we yeah. have hardly honk. Yeah, hardly at all, I think. I'm just waiting for the Baroda Ahmedabad Expressway. What do you mean? We are on it. No, we, are, we, are, we are still not on it. This is it? This is not it. Dude, it is not this. This is not Baroda Ahmedabad oh, Express. Look at that. Look at this truck. It's overturned. So we are not on the expressway. That expressway is totally covered. Both sides fenced in. I don't understand. When you leave a road like this, I mean, this is already way better than the Bombay Pune Express. <laughs> now we are going to get on to the Baroda Ahmedabad Expressway. That is supposedly the finest in India. Just panning into the sky. Just have a look. Oh. On the NE1 <coughs> at the toll plaza, people staring away. Ah, Joe, nano, nano. Bow, fine, bow, nano, gadi. Look at this uncle in the truck. <laughs> He's waving out to me. We've already driven for roughly about 10 kilometers on this expressway. And it's already far superior than the Bombay Pune Expressway because it's made of tar. So it's complete Lamborghini territory. So what is the length of the Bombay Pune Expressway? Around 110. Yeah. And they charge us 140. 100 for an expressway that has never seen maintenance, which is bumpy as hell, as compared to this. Totally fenced in, super smooth, tarred expressway. I can give you a shot of uh, family in the whole of original Nano, Maruti Nano. <laughs> As you can see from the side, we have 333 kilometers to go for our night stop. And here we are, back on tar. The oh, concrete section is only near the toll. If it's 333 kilometers, 60 kilometers to an average, we'll reach there by the next five, five and, hours. and a half hours. So six thirty. Six thirty, which would be we would three, three hours, hours ahead of schedule. The other interesting thing is that there are no speed limit signs. There are no speed limit signs on the Bombay. Oh, there are. Sure, there are. That's the Vartak River. Absolutely dry. Back on the expressway. Super smooth. Boring. Sam got the wheels at the right time. What do you say? Absolutely. Though I must add, the road from Navsari to Baroda was more exciting, smoother, nicer. This one is just extraordinary, but when you look at it, the road is begging for a super car. That's what it's doing. Super lane discipline. Yeah, absolutely wonderful. Nobody has overtaken us from the left. Every time we overtake somebody or somebody patiently waits behind, no honking, no misbehaving. Beautiful landscape to your left and right. Lots of forests and rivers and lakes, fields, farms with horses and cows. Flowers. 20 kilometers, 20 kilometers from Ahmedabad. Sky. You know, we could be anywhere in the world. Beautiful marked exits and signs. The exits are perfectly laned. There's a proper dividing line between the thing. There's a caution merging traffic sign. Honestly, this road could be anywhere in Europe and it would be the same. It has been there since the time Sam has taken over. Yeah. He's never used his left foot either for the clutch, neither for the brake. 
Nothing, we haven't slowed down for a second. And he hasn't started shaking at all. No. <laughs> oh, we have another one, identical. Oh, now okay. we have two butterflies that have been killed by a viper. And both of them identical, only a distance of 150 kilometers between them. 